Good morning, you guys. We're going to start with an insanity. We're going to do 30 minute round today. So that means we're taking one of our blocks out, but it's still going to be a high intensity workout. So try to really go after it when you do your exercises, increasing our range or increasing the tempo or our speed to make things more challenging. So be challenged the whole time, be uncomfortable. And we'll go ahead and get started here in about 30 seconds. So if you need to start those smart watches, do so. Making sure you take little sips of water as you need to today. Stay hydrated. All right, you guys, start with this jog right here. Nice and light on our toes. If this high impact movement is not in your practice today, please modify, take it down. Keeping one foot firmly planted on the ground the whole time, just moving those knees, moving your arms, or adding the hop if you're ready and going there today. Nice and easy. All right, we're going to keep one foot grounded, step back in this lunge, and reach with that same arm as leg steps back, and gently alternate between the two. So we're getting a little Saxon bend here, reach, and release. So the front foot bears our weight, back foot is there for stability, so you're staying light on those toes as you step back, but nice and strong. Good athletic positioning, so soft knee, chest over that thigh, keep reaching. All right, from here I want you to do a side to side lunge, step, step, reach. If we're ready, we can add a little hop in there, remember that's your option, you don't have to go there if you're modifying. Go into a walk. Good job. Stay here. Come on. Adding the hop. We're going to jack feet and we're going to add a twist. So we're taking these arms side to side. Kind of like you're holding onto a ball. Engaging that core. Good job. Moving, you guys. All right, from here, take those feet wide, firmly planted on the ground. Go down in a double halt squat and lift. First time through, we're gonna stay right here. Down, two, and left. Down, two, left. If you want to add a heel raise here, you can. So as we lift, we lift up those heels. Down, two, lift. Good job. All right, sideways on. I'm gonna walk down those legs, walk into a high plank, and then back. All the way up. So it's nice and slow. Good job, you guys. From here, find your high plank and hold. So maybe some of us are holding it here, good, and maybe we press down into down dog. So we shift that weight forward, shoulders over those wrists, and then press those heels low. Keep moving, you guys. If you need to hold this stretch at the back, hold it longer. If not, we're going back up. So we have this step back lunge. We reach that same arm as leg that steps back. Reach. So you should feel this nice side body stretch. Reach out through those fingertips. Good job. Warm up. We go through this two times. So we're on our second time already. Woo. Back to those side to side lunge. Side, hop, hop, reach. Good work. Just start to feel that heart rate increase. Maybe not quite to our 140 or more yet, but we're getting there. Keep moving, you guys. 
to those jack feet, add that twist. Good work, good work. Keep moving, you guys. Stay with that. Down two and left. Down two, left. Almost there. Good. To those inchworms. So we're climbing down those legs all the way into our high plank. Hold and then bring it back. Nice and tall. Reach. Good job, you guys. And back. Woo. Keep going. Hold this high plank for me. Nice and strong. Then we're going to shift backwards. Press your heels low. Shift forwards. Lock it in that core. Gently shift back.
Try not to let them drift in or out. Stay light on your toes, pushing down with the whole bottom of your foot in your squat. Right there, shake it out. Little sips if you need it. Keep going, you guys. Heart rate should feel like it's 140 or more. You're breathing a little heavier. Let's keep it up there. Remember those broad jumps? Yep. Second time through. Be ready. Here we go. Left leg softly back three times. Good job. So good. Nice. Keep going. Yep. Use your arms. That will help give you momentum going forward. Hold it here. Forward and back. Drop that chest slightly. Can we move our feet a little bit faster? Keep moving, you guys. Yes, you can. Keep going, come on. I want you uncomfortable right here. Should not feel like you can hold this all day. Find your high plank. Perfect form first, so squeeze your quads, shoulders above those wrists. Now we can add a row here. If you're rocking, take your feet wider. Pull, pull. Maintain that proper plank for me. Pull. Pull. Up you go. Your squat variation. Sit down two and lift. Down two. Can you go a little bit lower? Yes, you can. Come on. Push yourself here. You got this. Woo. Right there, shake it out. Nice job. One more time through, and then we have a power move. We are combining our forward and back tops with our squats. Okay? If you're new to our insanity, our power move is one minute. And it's usually a combination of two of the exercises that you've just been doing. Okay, here we go. Big jump forward. Hop back. Restart. Use those arms. Lentil ball heel. Good work, good work, you guys. Love it. Come on. Hold it here, forward and back, press that door. Moving our feet quickly, or you're walking those feet quickly. Come on, keep pushing. Light up those toes. Can you go a little faster? Yes, you can. Come on. Find that high plank. So you're here, and pull, pull, pull. Looking about six inches in front of your fingertips for me, limiting that rock side to side with a wider feet. Back up you go, your squat down to you. Pop at the top. Good job, team. Woo! Almost there, almost there. Come on. All right, forward and back, you have eight. Then you go down for two, squats, lift, down two, lift. Hold it here, eight. Any combination in there, down 
Arms heel. Left. Pull top. Press. Hold here. Down heel. Hop up. Back and forth. Halfway there. Come on, team. Get a little lower in those squats. Hold the top. Yep. Keep pressing. Keep moving. Down two. Together. Right there. Nice job. Get some water. Okay. So normally we do a strength block. We're skipping that today. We're moving right into our um, bigger movements with block three. So get a little sip of water. Keeping today's class around 30 minutes. Okay? You'll be good, I promise. Get in. So we start the high spin. Then we have high knees, butt kickers, and scissors. So we're moving laterally and forward and back linear, okay? Nice and easy. Right here, one, two, three, high spin. I want that back room, I want your arm to press to the back of the room. Right there. You're staying on your toes. Get the movement first, then you add your speed. Drive that knee up. Good job. Right there. Staying on those toes. You got it, team. Yep. Hold it here, high knees. So I'm taking it to a jog. I like to add a tap. If you don't want to add a tap, just have my runner arms right here. You can make it a walk, drive those knees up a little higher. If you're into a sprint already, you can go there. So there's options. I usually go right in the middle. But you do you. Keep pushing. Hold it here. Let's get those heels up. So I like to get those heels. We're stretching this quadricep now. Move your arms. Nice turn your arms. Relax those hands. Stay mine on our toes the whole time. Keep moving. Good job, you guys. Hold it here, scissors. So we have these runner arms, and then we're pressing that heel behind us. So it's a little bit straighter of a leg. Yep. Oh, don't worry. We're gonna progress on this guy. Add some lateral movement coming up, but not yet. Stay right here. Get that movement first. Keep your hips facing forward for me. Right there, shake it out. Woo. Are you sweating yet? Yes. All right, your high spin. Here we go. One, two, three, draw that knee up. Open up that arm to the back of your room so you feel this chest opener. Squeeze that shoulder blade back. Keep going right here. You might have gotten an extra 10 seconds. That's okay. Keep moving, you guys. Press, 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 press. here, your high knees. Then we can add a tap or a sprint. If you're there or a jog, draw that knee up, adding a little hop at the bottom or a block. More of a flat foot at the bottom, dragging that knee up. Keep going. Yes, you can. Hold it here, get those 
heels up. So I drop my chest slightly here. So I have my good athletic positioning. Center of gravity is lowered. Staying light on my toes and getting those heels up each time. You got this. Keep moving. Scissors, heels down. Progressions, lateral and back. Yep. If the lateral movement's too much for you, stay in standing one position. Take the lateral out. Yep. Keep going, team. Keep going. Right there. Shake it out. Good job. One more time. We are combining our high knees with our butt kickers. So you'll do about eight and eight, okay? All right, last time through. We got this. All right, your Heisman team, ready? Here we go, one, two, three. One, two, three, open up. today's round and then we'll finish with some core okay so we'll be right around that 30 minute mark breathing heavier now yes good all right let's get our jog on right here nice and easy Decide 
like what? Dig deeper moves you want to do, or just go with me. Good work, team. Good work. Nice and easy. Yep. So I'm going into that jack of the twist. You did this in warm up. Holding that ball, locking in my core, quick on those feet, staying on the toes. Nice.
So we can have a hold, or we add that dip. Or we take this bottom knee down, and we can still add a dip here. So do what works for you. You can add a hold to start. The dip is our progression. Keep holding, stacking those shoulders. Try not to over-rotate that top arm. Keep reaching out through your fingertips. You're gonna rotate and go to the other side. I'm gonna face you still. Good. Keep those shoulders stacked. Keep your hips lifted. Stay strong here. Now if your neck's getting tired, look down. Or you can look straight up if that's more comfortable. Doesn't have to be straight out. I'm just looking at you. Keep going. Love it. Right there, you guys, and gently bring yourself back up. Woo, two more times. So we're adding layers to our practice, yes? Now we're gonna start this block four core work. We got it. So good, you guys. All right, arms up. Here we go. Smash that leg. Hammer down. Really focus on contracting your abs. That pull squeeze. And then that full extension. Pull squeeze. Yep. Got this. Woo. Nice job, team. Find your high plank. Right here. Squeeze it in. Do you have to drop that bottom knee 
certainly not. You can stay in that full extension, both feet out. You can add this hip lift. It won't have as big of a range. And you will certainly feel this side oblique action. You flip over. I'm facing you. Stack your shoulders. Lift and lower. Reach. Thanks for practicing with me today. 